my name is Gucci Vivian Uka. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Yay! If this is your first time here, welcome. And if it's not your first time here, welcome back again. As you can see, I'm wearing a tiara. Somebody gave it to me. And the reason why I'm wearing it is because it is my birthday. Oh, well, almost. So, in this video, I want to tell you more about me because I feel like many people don't really know me. I just talk about topics and you're probably wondering who is this Ugochi, who is this Vivian, who is this Uka, who is she? So yeah, today I'm gonna give you 10 facts, just tiny facts about me, simple tiny facts. Number one, my birthday is on April 24th. So many years ago, many many years ago, well not so many but some years ago, I was born on a Sunday. I'm not gonna tell you the year but since I've told you it's on a Sunday, you can go find out what days what years did april 24th fall on a sunday and then you can figure out my age so yeah i was on april 24th which means i'm uh my sign is stars if you care about those stuff i don't really care about it and it's represented by the bull and some people say we are stubborn blah 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 me i'm calm i'm peaceful not stubborn you know just who i am anyway so that's one fact about me number two i have five siblings yes and it's so shocking because a lot of people ask me, like when I put up pictures and I say happy birthday to my brother or happy birthday to my sister, people who I even think should know me better, they're like, how many siblings do you have? I thought you had only one brother. I thought you had only three brothers. I was, like they're always guessing stuff. And I have five siblings. We are six children in my family from the same parents, um, three boys and three girls. And, and I am number four in my family. And the order is boy, girl, boy, girl, and then girl, boy. Yeah, so my parents did a good job. Yeah, so um, you probably notice I post my pic um, pictures of my sisters more because they take pictures. My brothers don't seem to take pictures, so there's nothing for me to post of them. So that's it. But yeah, I have three brothers. Older than two people. Mm -hmm. Now, number three, my favorite color. For anyone who cares, I tell them my favorite color is blue. Blue, 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 blue. But nobody believes me. Some people say my favorite color is yellow, aka my younger sister. And some people think my favorite color is pink. Honestly, any color that looks good on me, when I wear it, I'm going to wear it and I will love it that day. The next day, I'll probably forget about it. So that's how I roll. That's my favorite color blue for now but it could be pink tomorrow yellow today any any day depends on my mood all right number 40 about me um i have lived in three continents and four countries so i was bred i grew up in nigeria um and uh i moved to ghana and then so that's the second country so nigeria then ghana then i moved to europe right uh and i was in sheffield i lived in sheffield um for a while and i also lived in oxford for a short while and then i moved to uh north america and i lived in um in canada in vancouver and in montreal so africa for nigeria and ghana europe for sheffield and north america for um canada so those are my three continents and four countries Speaking of continents, I have been to five continents. Five. I don't know why I keep removing uh, my hands. And so that's my number five tip, I think, right? Number five fact about me. I've been to five continents. Um, Africa, um, Europe, North America, South America, Asia. So it's mainly Australia for me and nobody cares. I mean, I mean, if I get a chance to go to Antarctica, then I will go. But yeah, so I'm sure I really want to go to. And I have been to over 21 countries. I can't list them for you. I have them written somewhere, but off the top of my head, I can't list them. But a lot of the countries are in Europe that, that I've been to. And that's because um, Europe is quite small. So you just hop on a train and you go to another con country, you explore, or you hop on a quick flight. And yeah. But in Africa, I've been to Nigeria, Ghana, and South Africa, and Egypt, yeah, Egypt in Africa, yeah, so, and South South America, I've been to Mexico, Mexico, and I've been to US, Canada, and um, Asia, I've been to Malaysia, and um, um, Singapore, that's where, yeah, that's the places I went to, 
Yeah, number uh, six tip about me, my favorite food. I love Oha soup. You probably don't know it if you're not Igbo, but ask any Igbo Nigerian person. Oha soup is like the best soup in the world. I love it. And I love it with fufu, apple, loi loi, whatever you want to call it. I just like to like grab it and just oh, eat it. And my mom cooks the best Oha soup in the world. Yes, I said so myself. So it's delicious. I love it. That's how I like to eat it. Um, my next best food is actually yam. So if it's not soup, it's yam. Like if you like bring me boiled yam, fried yam, grilled yam, roasted yam, toasted yam, yam porridge, anyhow you want to make yam, you give it to me. I can finish it two bowl of yam. I love yam. Unfortunately, I haven't eaten yam in several years. It's been so long I've eaten yam, but that's like one of my best foods. And speaking of, of food, fact about me, I don't eat indomie. I can't stand the smell. I can't stand the look. I just don't like indomie and I don't eat noodles in general. However, I love pasta. They are different. Don't tell me that they're the same. They're made from different things actually. So some people are always like, oh, how can you eat indomie? I not eat pasta or how can you eat pasta? I don't eat indomie. They're different. I also have a friend who eats noodles but doesn't eat pasta. So yeah, I don't eat indomie. And I also do not drink dairy. You know they say smoking gari, you put gari with sugar and stuff. The last time I did that was in secondary school. I've never tasted gari again since then. I just don't know why I would want to drink gari. I'm not going to say what my father says about that, but let me just zip my mouth. But I don't drink gari. And so that's the fact about me. Um, What are my hobbies? So you can tell I'm not counting, but I think this is number eight. What are my hobbies? If you follow me on social media, you'll see that i like to dance i love music i like to dance doesn't mean that i'm a good dancer i just like to move my body i dance almost every single morning it's part of my workout i dance however it is that it comes to me i also used to do ballroom dancing so salsa cha 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 you know tango and waltz um so i love to dance i love to sing as well and i used to be part of uh the choir in my secondary school and also in church but I lost my voice one time where I couldn't even speak. And then after that, my voice didn't really come back. And so now sometimes when I sing, it sounds off key, but we're managing. But so I like music. I like to sing, dance. I like to read. And these days, I don't have as much time to read because I'm reading academic stuff. But I like to read novels, books. And I also like to write. I actually write stuff myself. And I used to write. Uh, I have a blog. So that's another fact about me. You can check it out on www.ugochivuka.blogspot.com. And I also used to write for Bala Naida uh, as well. Um, so yeah, I like to write. I like to travel, obviously. Travel, I miss it so much. I can't wait for this pandemic to be over by God's grace. And then I can travel again um, by God's grace. So yeah, I love to travel. Um, and I love to eat. Actually, I think... I spend most of my time thinking about food. There are days when I wake up in the morning and I'm thinking about my breakfast for the next day. And I'm serious. Like, I'll wake up and I'm like, oh, I already know what I'm eating this morning. Uh, yeah, I think I know what I'm eating this afternoon. Like, but what about tomorrow morning? <laughs> I always, and then I remember the Lord's Prayer. Give us this day, our daily bread. I'm like, oh, okay. I'm already praying for the next day's bread. But yeah. And even sometimes when I'm reading my Bible, because I'm Christian, and I'm reading my Bible, or when I'm listening to Mass or anything, and they're talking about Jesus breaking bread and fish, I just get so excited. I'm like, yes, we have something in common, bread and fish, food. Yeah, anyway, so that, that's another fact about me. Food, I like food. Yeah. Um, another fact about me, I don't know what number we're in right now. Another fact about me is that I have um, three university degrees, actually four university degrees. Right, so I have a bachelor's degree in bi in biochemistry. I have a master's degree in public health, health services research. I have a single diploma certificate, so it's not really a degree, but a single diploma certificate in business administration. And then I have a PhD in reproductive and developmental sciences. So yes, and so the schools I went to, if you want to know, for secondary school I went to. Federal Government Girls College Owerri. 
<laughs> and then I went to um, University of Ghana, Ligon. I went to University of Sheffield in England. And I went to University of British Columbia, Vancouver. And yo, that's all you have from me about um, education. So clearly, as people say, I like book. And I also like people that like book. So if you like book, me and you, we can be friends easily. We can talk about books and what more and books and books and books yeah um what else about me um hmm oh um just a fun fact i was in the matching band in my secondary school so i know how to swing my arms pretty well i was even the leader i became the leader in my final year secondary school of um, my hostel my geometries matching band which is purple house so yeah i know how to match pretty well and you know swing my arms very straight which is about the only thing i know to swing straight but yeah that's it <laughs> and i guess the last tip about or the last um what's it called last fact about me i have a youtube channel which is what you're watching right now so please subscribe if you haven't and please grab your friends to subscribe as well do it for me as a birthday present please subscribe if you haven't and then whether you have or you haven't also get like 10 people to subscribe to my youtube channel and i hope to bring you more and more content that will keep you entertained keep you happy keep you educated and keep you safe i don't know only god can keep you safe but you keep or you keep yourself safe but please until next time um stay safe stay happy and thank you so much for watching my video i appreciate you all coming even for the one minute videos i post for the silly videos i do and all sorts of videos thank you so much i really really appreciate all of you it's been a wonderful journey um i started um posting more stuff on my youtube i've had this channel for a while but it was private and then i started posting stuff um last year during the pandemic everybody's talents came out during the pandemic and it's been really nice and um, also follow me as i said on my blog www.ugochibiuka.blogspot.com and um yeah i also write stuff once you know from time to time there i should do better and i'm trying to do better and i'm also hoping to write something soon so please stay tuned and i hope you will support me when that time comes thank you very much again and thanks for watching and happy birthday to me Ooh. okay bye